Okay, we got Sparky in the blue playing Nuru versus Lego Man playing Caesar in the red. This is Meadow, which is a bit of a complicated map. A lot going on visually as well. Definitely a very nice looking map as far as decorations go. Maybe a little bit chaotic at times, but... We're going to take a look. Both players doing standard opening things. Swords coming out. We've got Nero versus Caesar, which is going to be interesting because Caesar is regarded as one of the better commanders in this game. Nero, not so much. Okay, we see that sword capture coming in here. Lego Man going to get Caesar out relatively soon. And Sparky didn't send a sword. Oh no, there we go. Right, the sword's going into the right position now. And the question is, is the commander going to heal? No. So neither commander are going to heal off of these ports. Which uh, are largely just used for reinforcing. Getting like merfolk and frogs out and like. What's Sparky going to do? Probably just teleport out. Even go for these midfield captures. Murder teleports out too, and oh, we're gonna see a small skirmish over on that left hand side. Now, of course, hitting a sword on flagstone, not going to drive it below half health, but oh, and it's actually gonna try and go toe to toe with the sword that hit it. Goes up on that mountain tile, and I think, in theory, the initial attacker would still win just because of the way like they they still have a, an advantage in terms of health and you know of course tile defense gets weaker the lower health you are so that mountain tile not really having a huge impact when you're at 30 percent health but it's fine I'm just gonna back up and we're seeing trying to heal Lots of infantry around, so actually. These could get ready to do some kind of big push with that. 65% health, so. Yeah, could see Caesar Groove come up relatively soon. Nuru only at 50. But we're going to start seeing, you know, knights lining up for crits. And Sparky just going to continue to push right now. Wagon coming out, interesting. Kind of difficult to move around on terrain on this map, so yeah, the wagon would have to go around here, through this like chopped forest tile, and then... Yeah, that's a fairly immobile... ...unit right there. Okay, nice sword crit getting lined up, Caesar getting close to Groove now. What can Sparky do? Okay, air trooper gonna capture this village. Frog coming out. Definitely going to see some interesting plays there. Now we see the commander starting to be aggressive. Nuru going to build a lot of groove actually off of that. And Sparky just going to pull back to a more defensive position. Use that sword as a blocker. Because yeah, it's not going to do well against the knight in all toe to toe, but it means their knight gets the first hit. And yeah, just a bunch of repositioning. Knight versus knight really comes down to whoever lands the first hit. Sparky just want to give Lego Man an opening, and Lego Man building another knight is going to be coming down to reinforce Caesar as well. Just going to be who can outposition their opponent in this circumstance. And this is a huge wide open map with like fairly close strongholds, but neither player really going for any kind of stronghold play right now. Both just want to control the sides. This is TYM as well, so you know this could be a longer game. You never know. Ooh, nice pick up there. We're gonna see the village go down and yeah, just a bunch of swords being used as blockers. Nuru comes across to help protect this flank too. Alright, frog. And walk up the right hand side as well. And oh, Caesar gonna hit a village. Not gonna take it down, so this is just for damage. And I guess it helps build some groove. And this is a weird circumstance where I don't know if it's worth Caesar using groove. Oh, that's a nice trap actually. Knight is gonna get stuck there. 
And I don't think there's a way to bust out, so. Nice positioning there from Lego Man. Yeah, they get their own frog. They get a rifle in that corner too. Frogs actually very particularly combo well with uh, rifles. But Nuru's gonna groove. Rocky gets one out as soon as they can. Oh, rifle crit. And the pullback of the frogs. So, as I was saying, frogs and rifles work very well together. And there's an example of that. Just pulls the rifle back to safety, puts the unit in front. And yeah, Sparky's looking to be in good shape. And a lot of defense over his friends. Like, there's no anti air to deal with this knight, or to deal with this dragon, sorry, and this harpy. And Lego Man, who was looking pretty good before, they have a mage that is very far out of position, a witch that I guess could slowly get into position, but. ideal at all. Okay, Caesar just gonna sit there. Go for that hit on the village again. And yeah, two turn on a village. Pretty good. He built a little groove that way. Lego man. Oh, actually just gonna move the witch over to the left hand side? Okay. There is a mage to deal with that. Now what can Sparky do? I mean they've got a rifle and a frog. They can do quite a lot. Second rifle actually coming across now. Okay, Harpy is going to get some nice damage here. And the dragon going to do some good work. It's a little bit of a loop de loo there with the, the wagon, but this is actually looking quite threatening on the stronghold. There isn't really anything defending it, so maybe Sparky just goes for a quick uh, one-two punch on the, the stronghold. Oh, nice pullback there. Rifle's going to get another crit. Picks off another unit. And Nuru looking a little bit risky at the moment for them. I don't know if uh, that's an entirely safe place for them to be. A sword hit off planes? Suicide? No. So. Follows up with a spear crit. And I think if you just want to go for damage, you probably hex first. Just so your units take less damage on the counter attack. And do more damage as well. Okay, so... Barking in chat saying that like their commander is actually completely safe there. Uh, even if everything hits them in the correct way. So... I guess Lego Man just realized, oh wait, I just didn't attack into the commander correctly there. And I think they were in a position where they were going to lose Stronghold. Caesar would have to spend Groove at an awkward time to defend. Uh, and then yeah, you're losing this offense. You're losing your defense on the left hand side, like your opponent's offense is doing really well. I really like the play with the frog and the rifle Groove. I think that was really smart. Just, and the value generated as well, like able to get two kills in two turns. I mean, sure, you're only killing like light infantry units, but a kill is a kill. And if you're doing that while doing other plays as well, then, you know, it works out really nice. But yeah, very nicely done there by Sparky. They take the game. And uh, I Lego Man actually did pretty good too. Like I have to say, like, this wasn't like some super one-sided game. Like I think... Lego Man had the potential to uh, come back uh, so long as like Sparky like gave them an opening but in this case Sparky was playing very solid so yeah good game.